Okay, after much debate, Mr. Lindblad's finally figured this out. In order to do problem number four, you've got to remember that there are 12 months in a year. So you take 8,000 times 0 0.06, and then we divide it by 12. When we do that on our calculator, 8,000 times 0 0.06 divided by 12, we get $40. So then you have $8,040 times 0 0.06, and then times 1 over 12, 1 or 12, or divided by 12. So when you do that second one, 8,440 times 0 0.06 divided by 12, you end up with $40.20. And then you re-add that to the 8,040, and you end up with $8,080.20, which is our answer. All right, sorry about that last one. Had to rethink how we're supposed to do it. Okay, good luck on this. I did number four and number two for you. That means you got one and three to do on your own. Good luck.